Hi everyone, this is Farah. Uh, I'm going to be teaching you how to do two very simple DIY projects for Father's Day. It's coming up on Sunday and I thought why not because I was going to make them anyway. So here we are. I'm going to show you how to make a sh um, coffee scrub and for, for men and also um, a nice aftershave cream that they can just use after you know they do their, their daily shave. And it's great for moisturizing their skin and for just you know using it on a daily basis. So I'm gonna start with the coffee scrub. For this I've got like a little tiny jar and I'm gonna fill it up, let's say maybe three quarters of for coffee. Something like that, so you can see. I don't measure very much, but <laughs> I hope you can see how small the jar is. So, whatever you're doing, it's just up to three quarters, and you just add the rest with brown sugar. Let's see a little bit, so I will show you when I add it. So, you add the brown sugar. This brown sugar, like this was already infused with ginger. I, I always put a lot of things in my sugar and salt and stuff like that. So this is already very gingery. If you can, you want to, you can do that. So here you go, you've got the coffee and you've got the sugar. And then you add the fractionated coconut oil. I've got this one with the pump, which really helps when you add that's it. You just basically try and pump as much as you can until you have a moist um, mixture. So you turn it. Oh, I'm making a mess already. As you can see. So you mix, 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 and then you see how wet your mixture is, or how oily. Oh, it smells lovely. So I would say maybe about three tablespoons of um, fractionated coconut oil or jojoba oil, any carrier oil will do. So that's kind of the consistency. <laughs> I don't know if you can see this. But um, kind of nice and wet, not too oily. A little bit, because I think it just dried a little bit. Yeah, it's really up to you how you, how want, most you want it, but nice and not too oily, not too kind of drowning in the oil, but just nice and um, wet. Oh, it's a mess. <laughs> okay, so that's done. And then you you um, you can add your essential oils in here. So I'm adding two drops of lemon each lemon. Medaluka and lavender. It's a really, really nice combination. So two of each. Maybe three. Let's say three. Okay, three. They deserve it. <laughs> so this is Melaluca. Three Melaluca. And then three lavender. And they're really, really good for the skin. And really good for, you know, scrubbing. So, and even if they don't want to scrub their body, you know, men don't like want to do that, maybe they do, they can just use it for their hands, you know, it's so nice when they have, you know, a, a day work, if they are, you know, um, they have a, a mechanic job or they do work with their hand, it's just nice to scrub all the dirt, to scrub all the dirty skin and the dead skin, and that's it, you're done, that's it, you just mix it, you're done. Close your little jar. You can find this jar in um, everywhere, really. I got them from the range, so you can get them anywhere. You mix, 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 and that's it. You make it with love, <laughs> and you write down what, what it is here, and you've got a nice scrub, coffee scrub for your man, or for your father, or for your um, brother. So, one done. Now we're going to do the um, uh, aftershave cream. All you need is extra virgin coconut oil, normal coconut oil, and I add a little bit of vitamin E, and again you can find it in any health shop, and Douglas fir, because it's really good for the skin and really cleanse the skin as well. So just a little tiny 
in and I'm going to add about, uh, I would say, two tablespoons. I'm using a small spoon here. But two tablespoons will do, like this. And I'm going to add two drops of the vitamin E. One, e, two. <laughs> and then I'm going to put about five drops of Douglas fir. Because it smells quite manly as well. So they don't feel like they are becoming like a, a girly kind of daily routine. But it's nice for them to, to learn how to look after the skin and the face after shaving. That's it. Oof, smells lovely. It's very, very nice. Very lemony as well, but it's not um, too kind of flowery or anything like that. It's very, very, very good for men um, aroma. The other thing, um, if you want to use lemon in anything you want to use lemon for, like the cream or anything that you expose your face to the sun afterwards with, avoid it. Avoid lemon, any citrus oil, when you are making something with it and then you go to the sun. So that's why, let's say for this shaving cream, what you can use any oils you want and whatever is drawn to your, you know, the, the, the person you want to give to this to. But as long as, even for yourself you can use it, but as long as um, you don't put any citrusy oil in that, you can put anything else. And you are done with this, that's it. This is your shaving cream for your husband or your man or your partner or your brother or your son. And then that's it, you just gift it to them for Father's Day. And I have a little, have I got a little? Uh, yes. I've got a, just a tiny kind of um, little pouch, I'm going to call them, to put them in. You can decorate it, you can put a nice little word in here, whatever you like. So that's it, you've got two little gifts, which I'm going to gift my husband this. He's going to say, yeah, another DIY project yet again. <laughs> but here, you uh, fill it up all the way to um, three quarters of the jar with coffee, and then you top it up with brown sugar, and then you add the coconut oil or um, any, any uh, carrier oil. You add your essential oils. I have used lemon, melaleuca, and lavender, but you can use anything you like. And for this one I used, so the, the shaving cream, I used coconut oil, just normal coconut oil, but extra version. And I added uh, a little bit of vitamin E and a little bit of about five drop of the Douglas fir. And that's it, you've got a nice little pair of beautiful little gifts for your men in your life, or your father, or your brother, or your son. I hope you have enjoyed this. Share it, or talk about it, or let me know what you've done. Let me show me show me if you have done this. It's very very easy to do, and I'll be very very happy to see you getting on with your DIY project. Take care. Have a good day. Bye.